Hi guys, Sean Marenghi here. I hope you're doing very, very well. So, today's video is called Five Easy Steps to Build Your Self-Confidence. 2020, no doubt. I lied on the end. Um, if you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel and push the bell icon and my videos may pop up in your feed. So tip one for self-confidence, grooming, um, in the best possible sense of that word, you know, um, <laughs> showering, bathing, uh, dressing in a way that makes you feel okay or, or better, you know, um, accessories, maybe more freedom to do that if you're a girl, but you know, this sort of shit, uh, can help a little bit. Um, if you don't shower for a week, you feel a lot worse than <laughs> the end of a week where you showered every day, you know? Okay. Tip two, think positively. Easier said than done, but maybe change your relationship to good thoughts. Uh, and bad ones as well, but maybe welcome the good ones in a bit more. Uh, the Kevin Hart approach, <laughs> uh, he said, in the, in the darkest of tunnels that could be infinite, he'll, he'll find something positive in there. Um, which maybe explains his amazing drive and entrepreneurial brilliance and uh, heartbeat productions and all that stuff. And he's a bit fast and intense, but I can see why he's a brilliant comedian. A bit fast and intense for me uh, to watch the full thing. <laughs> Comfortably. Um, also, with regard to the thoughts, ch welcome in the good thoughts more, and you could may maybe make them into a bit of a mantra. So if you're lucky enough to get good thoughts occasionally, like, you know, you're doing all right, or you're doing really well, or the next 10 years are going to be great, make a mantra of repeating those. It may feel a bit contrived and stiff, but um, it's worth doing because it changes your psychology. Uh, and your outlook. All right, tip number three on self-confidence would be fake it until you make it. <laughs> Another cliche, I'm very sorry, but it's kind of true. Uh, so you're going about your day in the world, you've left the house, you've gone to the Shisha Cafe or the or the <laughs> Seven Dollar Hotel restaurant in Dubai or the Tea Cafe in Birmingham or the brothel in Lincoln. Who knows where? Um, you might be, but wherever you are, <laughs> be friendly, nice, kind, ask people how they're doing, um, compliment them perhaps, open doors, say please, thank you, and all the nice, polite things I'm sure that you do do anyway. All right, tip number four for self-confidence. Feel prepared. Uh, what's the old saying? Excuse me a second. Cheers. Fail to prepare is to prepare to fail. And there is great truth in that. You know, um, you don't want to go too masochistic with that and, and ruthlessly push yourself to not be a, not fail, not be a failure and overwork. You do need to relax. Um, for example, you, when you, you know it's time to go to sleep, but you decide to binge watch the entire <laughs> second series of Game of Thrones instead um, with all the killing and the nakedity and, and, the, and the brilliance, to be fair. It is brilliant. Um, <laughs> do some research on stuff that interests you that can motivate you and give you a more positive outlook okay tip number five on self-confidence would be small incremental goals okay so we're not <laughs> we're not talking world peace even though that would be pretty cool um, <laughs> we're talking you feel being 20% more positive about yourself tomorrow evening than this evening or tomorrow morning than this morning, you know? Uh, you've done some productive, you've, you've been a bit more engaged at work, a bit more conscientious at work. You've, you've been a bit nicer. You've complimented an old lady in the street because of her nice purple scarf, you know? Whatever it is, um, pull-ups, chin-ups, push-ups, uh, sit-ups, um, all the ups. <laughs> Maybe not all the ups. Definitely not all the uppers. Just to uh, make that clear. Right, look for a job. <laughs> I think I've, I've, I'm kind of talking to myself with that one. So maybe we'll, um, maybe we'll skip that. And make it a goal of yours every day to make one person smile. Even if it's just yourself. Uh, which is probably the most important thing. Because if you can try and heal yourself then and, and bring peace to yourself, you can bring peace to the world and that is what the world needs 
All right, guys, there were my top tip five. <laughs> top five tips for self-confidence. Number one, grooming in the best possible sense of the word. The shaving, the cleaning, the bathing, the nice, the clothes at work, the clothes at work. Um, number two, self-confidence. Think positively, you know, welcome in the good thoughts. Laugh, try and laugh a little bit at the bad thoughts, you know, uh, and Kevin Hart and all that. Um, <laughs> tip three for self-confidence was fake it until you make it. So, friendly, nice, outgoing, opening doors, uh, please, thank you. Tip number four for self-confidence, feeling prepared, because if you want to fail, then don't be prepared, because you will most likely panic and have a hollow content to whatever it is that you're about to put out there into the world. Tip five for self-confidence, the final tip, obviously. I did count to five successfully in this one. I didn't in my um, five ways to make people happier, five ways to helping people video, whatever I'm going to call it. I still don't know what I'm going to call it. Uh, yeah, small incremental goals. So not world peace, but like, I'm going to tidy the living room today, or I'm going to call my grandma today and uh, ask her how, she, how she's doing, or I'm going to track down an old lady and compliment her on her, how she's aged graciously and not done plastic surgery and looks weird to 60, but <laughs> has flourished naturally into the beautiful, dignified, older phase of womanhood, which I think uh, maybe young girls need to hear, judging from the amount of orange skin and huge eyelashes and, uh, and the rest of it that you see. So, and I'm not just talking about Donald Trump. So, that's it, guys. <laughs> Please subscribe. The channel, bell icon, share this around everywhere. Leave comments, leave any, any tips you think I'm missing out on self-confidence. Please let me know. Take it easy. Have a good day or evening or morning or middle of the night, wherever this is. Goodbye.